Uh, joining us on the phone right now, though, is Reed Rawson. She's a witness to what happened in that ho house in Santa Monica off the campus. Two individuals dead, one woman injured, apparently shot. Uh, where were you, uh, Reed? What, what did you see? What was going on? house when I heard the first shots and I ran outside into my yard and called 911 and as I was on the phone with 911 there were additional shots and I could see smoke coming from the neighbor's house across the street. I ran into the front yard realized that the woman had been shot. The lady who lives next door to us had seen all of the stuff happen. I'd seen the man come out. We saw the man in the car with the woman where he had taken the car and they sped off down the street and then you know, we realized this woman had been shot and the house was on fire and we tried to help everyone. Um, it all happened very fast. And you called 911, is that right? Yes. And, and what happened then? Uh, while I was on the phone with 911, we heard more shots and I saw the smoke. Um, and then I ran into the front yard. I saw the car drive away with the man in the passenger seat who had come out of the house. And there was a woman driving and another woman had been shot and her car was up on the sidewalk. At what point, this is video we're showing our viewers, Reed, this is video that you've shared with us. At what point did you get your camera out there and start taking these pictures? Uh, about 10 seconds after I came into the front yard, uh, someone was helping the woman who had been shot, and we, we got the hose out, and then I started taking video. Tell us about your neighborhood. Uh, is this a crime-infested neighborhood, a relatively quiet neighborhood? What kind of neighborhood no, is it? It's a very quiet neighborhood. So this is extraordinary, unusual. What what happened? Yes, it is very unusual. I have never seen anything like this. Do you have any indication, Reed, to believe that what happened at this house in your neighborhood has any connection whatsoever with the shooting incident over at the campus of the Santa Monica Community College? Um, we think that it might because we saw him drive off in that direction, but obviously none of us followed him, so we don't know if it's the same person. And do you know who lived in this house? I don't. I only knew that there was an elderly man who lived there that I had seen coming and going, but I've never actually talked to him or knew his name. So a lot of mystery still uh, there in the neighborhood, uh, mystery on the campus. Hopefully we'll get some of this cleared up momentarily when there's a news conference with local police. Uh, Reed Ross, and thank you very much for joining us. Uh, we also just heard from the hospital on the victims from the Santa Monica shootings on the college campus there, as well as this fire. We're awaiting word from the police on what they know about the suspect or suspects. Stay with CNN for all the latest breaking news out of California. Plus, we're also getting details on uh, millions of American uh, phone calls and uh, records of emails, texts, video chats, much more from overseas. How is President Obama defending the secret widespread government surveillance program? called PRISM.